this video, I'm gonna be sharing with you a very simple strategy for you to be able to beat the cover four match defense out of the trips tight end offset. What's up guys, my name's Cody, and I wanna thank you for taking the time to watch this video. Now, if you are new to the channel and you've never been here before, I wanna encourage you to click the subscribe button because my channel is all about helping people become better at Madden. So if you're looking to get better at this game, it's completely free for you to subscribe to this channel and it allows you to know and stay up most up to date with everything that we have going on here on YouTube. Now, uh, really quickly here, if you don't know, I actually released a, I released a video every single week it's only for the people that have texted me and it's basically a free offensive or defensive scheme so I sit down for one to two hours and I literally walk you step by step through a complete offensive or defensive scheme in the game in the past we've done things like the bunch the trips tied in the trip side in offset is what was the most recent one that we did the uh, a slot offset the Arizona bunch or the Arizona cluster I apologize the nickel 335 wide the big nickel over G as well as several other offenses and defenses and so if you want to get the all of those videos all of those schemes that we've done in the past completely Completely for free all you have to do is text the word Madden to my cell phone number which is 208-218-6900 okay my number is up in the top right hand corner of your screen it's also in the description so you'll be able to get a once you shoot me a message you'll be able to get a, a, a playlist that is going to be sent to you that has all of these schemes all of these free offenses and defenses rolled into one playlist for you and we're also updating this playlist every single week and so that way you're going to be able to stay most up to date with everything that we have so we're actually looking forward and schemes that we're planning for the future are the gun tight flex we might look at the arizona gun spread we're probably going to look at the 245 double a gap the 245 odd the 335 odd as well as several other defensive and offensive schemes so if you want to get those free schemes sent to you every single week completely for free just text the word madden to 208-218-6900 okay guys so we're going to be going over this play here and we're going to actually be working out of this play tight end in and we're going to break down how to use this as a match beater um, so i'm going to go ahead and put that cover four show two in my audibles and then just make sure that i don't have any crazy good pass rushes due to the practice and the sheds but what we're going to do is we're just going to share this with you. So it's relatively simple as far as the setup goes. Uh, literally, all we're going to do is we're going to put the square receiver on an out route. We're going to put the circle receiver on a curl. And we're going to put the X receiver or the tight end on a streak. And what you're going to see here is this triangle receiver will literally torch the match coverage over the top for a one play touchdown. So it's a really, really simple setup. Um, and it's literally, it's a one play touchdown every single time. It's very, very consistent. Um, the one issue with this play is that sometimes it does uh, kind of glitch out when you throw it just because of the type of route that it is. Um, so again, all you're doing is you're putting the circle receiver on a curl, you're putting the square receiver on an out, and you're putting the, the X receiver on a streak. Now, if you wanted to put the X receiver on a curl, um, you'll see right here, you could still do that, okay? It's all about vertical. When you're when you're trying to learn how to beat match defenses, it is literally all about, um, it is all about vertical threats. We're trying to make sure that the defense knows that this person's a vertical threat or this person's a vertical threat. Now, the cool part about this play in particular is let's say that they, a lot of people, what they'll do is they'll put the, the safety that's on the, on the trip side of the formation, they'll put him into a, um, a deep half. The beauty of this play, especially if you use it like with double curls, what you're gonna notice is that a deep half will not defend it. I can pass lead this to the inside against a deep half. Look at that window right there. You see that right there? That's able to glitch it out both directions. That to me is what makes this so effective. Okay, I can literally, I can get it in both directions. So let me show you what I'm talking about again. A lot of people will just simply, just simply deep half the, the, the safety here. Okay, see that? I deep half the safety. Now let's say, let me show you another coverage beater. Okay, so if I went to the play X under and I put the circle receiver on a fade, you know, basically did this combination right here, you're gonna notice here that this circle receiver, if I try to throw it to him, he's gonna get boxed. 
right? There's not a window to throw. It. Another thing that you're going to notice is let's say that I'm running that tight end in play. Okay, so I'm going to run the same exact combination. Um, and if I'm running the same exact combination from tight end in, but I pass lead this to the left, well, I forgot the deep half. See, normally you're going to want to pass lead this to the outside. Okay, if they don't deep half, you're going to want to throw that to the outside because that's where the open passing lane is. Okay, now you might be saying, well, okay, so what happens when they deep half? Okay, well, let me show you. So if they deep half, then what you're going to see, you've got the double curls, double vertical threats here, which are also really good against zone. But if I try to throw this to the left, I'm throwing it right into the deep half, as you can see, and he's going to be able to, he's going to be able to at the very least be able to knock this ball down. So what I've got to do is I've got to recognize, okay, where's the, where's, you know, I'm looking at my routes and where is the safety in relation to that receiver? Is he outside or inside? In this example right here, he's outside. So I can throw the ball hard, pass lead inside, click on. I need to make sure that I'm swerve catching. But as you can see, it's a very clean read for you to be able to beat the cover four match. That's just one play out of several that we broke down out of the trips tight end offset. This offense is super, super good. It's probably one of my favorite offenses that I've released up to this date because of the balance, because of the fact that you have a phenomenal little RPO trap alert bubble. You also have a very nice corner route out of the play X under and the play level sale. Um, there's just so many things that you have going for you with this offense. This X underplay is super underrated, um, especially against things like Tampa 2. You're going to see that the circle receiver can get uh, in a really, really good uh, position. I wasn't able to complete the pass, but he's in a very good position. So anyways, if you want to get this offense or if you want to get any of the other schemes that we have for you for completely free of charge, all you have to do is text the word Madden to my cell phone number, which is 208-218-6900. Thanks for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it, and we will see you guys on stream tonight.